everybody welcome back to my channel so for today's video I will be showing you guys my concealer collection so from my previous video you saw that I discussed all my primers and I'm doing a makeup collection series by category so this is my second video and this time I'm gonna show you guys all my concealers in my makeup collection so if you're interested to find out what concealers that I use and I like, please keep on watching. So the first concealer that I'm going to show you is from the brand Benefit and this is their Erase Pace Concealer and this one is in number one, shade one which is Fair. This concealer is targeted for under eye and this has a very peachy salmon um, undertone. So this is perfect if you have dark circles. This will cover that kind of imperfection. This is really thick, so you have to blend this very, very carefully because you don't want to like put so much product and it tends to cake on your under eye. So this is really nice if you have, uh, I would say, a dark circles and some people have more like, you know, purple undertone under their eyes. So this is really nice and really good to cover those kind of imperfection. So this is from Benefit and this one costs about, I guess, $23. I think they changed their packaging now. So this might not be the, the packaging of the new Erase Paste. So another one that I got is, this is just a sample size again from Benefit and this one is the Boeing Concealer. And this, I got this in the shade number 2. And this one, I only use this for blemishes because it's just the right uh, amount consistency. It's kind of thick and a little dry so you have to um, kind of warm this before applying it to your face. But this covers really good, so if you have blemishes, this is really nice and perfect. I know they also changed their packaging of their bowing. Again, this one is, um, it costs $23 for the full size, but I only got this um, sample size. So this is the bowing from Benefit. The next one that I, have, that I have is also from Benefit and this one is their Fake Up Concealer and this one comes in this tube. It's like a roller, um, kind of like a lip, lip gloss, lip balm. This um, product is also a sample size and this one has like a moisturizer and then the concealer in the middle. So. This is perfect for hydration and for under eyes. So as you can see that the consistency is very smooth. It glides on perfectly. And I got this in the shade number one, which is light. I think all of their concealers comes in like three shades, like light, medium, and dark. But that's what I know, but correct me if I'm wrong, please comment down below. So this is fair. This has a very smooth consistency, I think, because of the moisturizer around the concealer that helps hydrate uh, the skin. So this is also nice for blemishes. And I also use this for under my eye. Again, this is just a sample that I got. And I think the full price of this is the same, about $23. So this is fake up. Now I'm going to move on to some of my favorite drugstore um, concealer. This one is from Maybelline and this one is the H Rewind Treatment. It's like the dark circle erase. So this comes in this packaging. It's like a twist up and it has like a sponge on the top. As you twist the product or as you twist the container, the product comes out on the sponge and you can just dab this all over your under eye. So this 
primarily targets the under eye so it removes dark circles so I only use this under my eye sometimes I use this as a brightening because I got this in the shade light so this is just perfect for me to just dub it under my eye and just um, on top of my nose and just do a little bit of highlight so the shade is perfect for me because it's more of like a pinker um, undertone which kind of helps brighten the eye. So this is from Maybelline. I have another concealer from Maybelline and this one is the Maybelline Fit Me Concealer and this one is in the shade 20. This is like my perfect shade concealer for my face and this is very creamy. This is the Maybelline Fit Me. It glides on really easily and there's no tugging. It's very smooth and creamy formula and you can use this all over your face. So some people use this as a foundation. Some use this as I use this personally for my blemishes and sometimes I put it also under my eye to cover and then just put the age rewind just to cover some um, drug circles so this works for me perfectly and I just love this I mean I forgot to mention the price of this I think the um, age rewind is about $10 and then the fit me concealer is about the same same price about between eight to ten dollars in the drugstore so this is one of my favorite. I keep coming back to me, Mom Maybelline Fit Me. Now I have another one which is from CoverGirl and this is their Ready Set Gorgeous Concealer. I love their foundation and this concealer is also very good. It is creamy, it's very smooth and it actually glides on my under eye. I picked up the shade this is light as well. Most of my concealer is light. I, I'm between light to medium um, skin tone, but I would always prefer like a shade lighter for my under eye. So this is the Cover Girl, and that's the Ready Set Gorgeous um, concealer. This concealer costs I would say about between seven to nine dollars in the drugstore, and I love love the Ready Set Gorgeous um, line. They're one of the most affordable line. Um, and CoverGirl, but they work superb. They're amazing. Next concealer that I have is from Rimmel London, and this is the Wake Me Up Concealer. I know this concealer is not available in the U.S., but I ordered this online from the U.K. because there's certain um, makeup that's only available in U.K. So this is one of the concealer that I love. Um, I have this in the shade let me see ivory which is 10 this one has a more peachy undertone for me which is perfect for my um for my skin tone I just love this because I think this one has like a vitamin C boosting agent that keeps your eye under eye brighter so this is very good. It has an antioxidant. It has an anti-fatigue effect. I also love their um, foundation. So I usually use them both together at the same time. So this is from Rimmel. The next one that I have is from Bare Minerals. I got this as a sample and it's called the Stroke of Light. This is more of a brightening, high, I mean brightening concealer. This is just a small sample that I have. It has a more pinkier undertone and I normally use this as a brightener. So not really as a concealer but as a brightener because this gives you a very nice dewy highlight under your eyes. So if you have if you want like a hydrating one, so you can definitely give that a try. The last concealer that I have on my collection is the most recent purchase that I have is from ColourPop and this is their no filter concealer. This is like I think one of the most opaque concealer that I have. It is really good to cover that dark circles and it gives you a very smooth application. 
The concealer is, I would say, like a kind of like a matte finish for me, like a satin matte. And the, the shade, this one comes in a lot of shade. And this is only $6. You can buy this from the ColourPop website. This is one of the best concealer. The one is amazing. It kind of like bends um, and glides onto your skin without tugging. And this is, I would say, one of the best drugstore concealer out there. Even though it's not available in the drugstore, but like price-wise, I would say this is like a drugstore um, counterpart. And it's just really good. It's really amazing. I've been using this almost every day with my makeup. And it just covers my imperfection, covers my dark circles, and gives me a more highlighted look. So I always, normally for all my concealers, I would get shade lighter because I want like a brightening effect under my eye. So these are all the concealers that I have in my collection and I would guarantee you that a lot of other people would have more concealers than I do but this probably like a lot for me now because I don't really use concealer like every day and if I do I would usually um, prefer my ColourPop one and again if you're on the market looking for a concealer maybe you could try one of this and see how it's all gonna work for you i don't have a luxury concealer because i would feel that concealer is one of the product that i would not use all the time so i'd rather just buy it in the drugstore and this drugs most of these are drugstore um concealer they work perfectly the only like high end that i have is from the benefit but they all work perfectly for me and that's all the concealers that I have in my collection. If you guys like this video, please give this video a thumbs up and please subscribe to my channel and I'll see you guys on my next video. Bye!